Hi, I am Sanjay Singh and I am 37 year old. I belong to Mathura and I am working in Singapore last 5 years. And my hair loss history is uh, last 10 years my hair was getting lost and I was just get upset because of my hair line and hair design. And then uh, I come to know the Saraswati hospital from my one of my friend. He gave me the reference for the doctor Saraswati and he I got to know that Dr. Saraswati is gold medalist in the skin and the hair treatment and before deciding the procedure I consult with the Dr. Saraswa team via phone and then I come to face to face counseling here when I meet two doctor I feel very comfortable and he explained in detail means how the hair growth is happen and how the line we they are going to create and how they are going for the before or after uh, treatment and I I'm I also meet with uh, Mr. Harin and we, then they are also explained a lot of things where I feel the comfortable because before that one I was just feeling that I don't know means how much pain will happen or how the surgery will go how it will take a long time and whatever they explained before before the the treatment I came here and I got to know that the treatment was very simple and this then I go for the surgery and surgery was uh, very painless only the uh, during the surgery time they put some anesthesia after that there is no pain and after hair transplant I can see my hairline whatever earlier is existing is the same as now and after two three uh, two three months I can see the hair was growing very nicely and now I can see my hair is growing very well and I, I can I can get this my self-confidence again where I can see oh, I just looks older than now you can see my hair style and I think costing wise is very nominal cost I can say if anyone can go for this one I will I would like to recommend the Saraswati hospital for the hair treatment and the skin also I can see because I, I just got the consultation for the some skin also that was also very well so if you are suffering from hair loss so that you have receding temples the triangle of both the temples has gone deep inside now if you want to comb your hair from one side with a side partition your one triangle goes deeper than the other if you do the other side your this triangle goes deeper than the other and there is no way that you can make your frontal hairline nice and tidy as you want it to be if this is the case maybe you are suffering from grade 3 Norwood Hamilton hair loss. So today I would like to discuss one patient of us, a case study of Mr. Sanjay who was a grade 3 hair loss person and who underwent a hair transplant after consultation with us. So let us discuss him and if you want to understand more about how and why, what all things can be done for him and for other people like you who have this hair loss, stay with me till the end. I'm Dr. Preeti Saraswat. I'm an American board certified hair transplant surgeon and subscribe our channel for more such informative case studies and videos. Mr. Sanjay Singh when presented to the consultation chamber, he told us that he has a family history of baldness from his father and maternal side. He had no other medical problem. He had never taken any hair loss treatment from any doctor. So after we consulted, about his blood pressure, other medical problems, any previous surgical history, any history of allergy, any tobacco or alcohol use. So all these complete history taking when we did. Then we did a trichoscopy for him so that we understand how the donor site is and how is the health of his hair and scalp. So before we do the transplantation, we have to do a long-term treatment planning for every patient which is customized for him so that he understands what can be the results of this hair transplant surgery if he has to take any medical treatment post surgery and what all things he has to take care what can happen after surgery so that he knows the timelines and he's well informed about it so after his trichoscopy when we talked about the trichoscopic findings we found that he had a good donor site his total number of grafts which he had at the back and which we could extract actually exceeded the numbers required at present so the total number of grafts which were required for him for his frontal area and a little bit of mid scalp was 
2203 and because he had 2.1 hairs per graft at the back so the number of hairs which we could take was more than twice other details of donor and recipient site you can see on the screen if you think this case study is helpful for you please click the like button mr sanjay when came on this day of surgery we had asked him to come with a heavy breakfast when we started his proceedings we firstly did the sensitivity test for all the drugs we were to use during the day be it the local anesthesia or the antibiotic we should be sure that you are not allergic to it your safety is our number one priority at saraswath hospital once the sensitivity was done then we did his hairline marking so as per his own wish and as we also according to our skill set we understood that his wish was okay it was nice the way he wanted his hairline we made it irregularly irregular so that the hairline looks very natural and then taking care of the rest of the area at the front and the mid scalp which we have to take into consideration we made the hairline and then we started with the next step the next step was that we trimmed his rest of the hair because he was comfortable with a trim scalp after the procedure after this we took him to the theater and then we did the slit making first so in the slit making we tried to keep the angle and the direction and the density according to his rest of the hair this is very important that when a doctor does this he or she takes into care that natural hair as they come out the hair which is transplanted should be according to that so that will bring a naturalness in the hairline and nobody will be able to identify that you have actually underwent a hair transplant after the slit making it was now time for graft harvesting so we did a harvesting in prone position from the back from the safe donor area it's very important that we do not cross the safe donor area because only then your hair transplant will stay for a much longer time after we took out the grafts and our staff segregated it under the microscope in one hair two hair three head taking care that the grafts should not dry out they should not be desiccated and also the lower end where the germ centers are they should not be touched by anyone at any point of time so our team is so skilled and experienced that they know the importance of no touch technique after that we again made mr sanjay lie down in a normal supine position after he took some refreshments and he was comfortable and then we transferred the harvested grafts to the pre-made slits in a fashion that the initial two rows receive single haired softer graft for a natural looking hairline and then the two and three haired or even four haired grafts were put in the tuft area so that if I talk to him from the front his tuft looks good and anyone talks from both the sides then his hair looks proper and dense this is very important in order to bring the artistic nature of a good hair transplant if you would like to understand any part of it which you were not able to understand which i'm talking about you can always ask in the comment section below so after completion of his surgery mr sanjay was called on the third day for the first head wash we prefer to do the first head wash at our own center by our trained staff but if you live overseas or you go back to your own place we always video assist you if you wish to ask any questions regarding you yourself or any of your friends or family for such a case as mr sanjay you can always call us on the numbers given below we can assist you after we did his first shampoo and we instructed him for all his medications and post-op care he went back to singapore at his working place after eight months he has now come back and he satisfied with his results we did a prp for him if you wish to know regarding cost of hair transplant you can click on the video on the left